Always one of the highlights of any season. Two clubs who represent an unbridled commitment to excellence. Stay with us for all the live action from the Tottenham Hotspur Stadium as Spurs take on Manchester United. And hello, wherever you're watching, welcome to North London. I'm Derek Ray, in position to bring you live match commentary, and my expert analyst, as always on these occasions, is Stuart Robson. And we've got Premier League action coming right up. It is Tottenham Hotspur up against Manchester United. Well, Derek, as is always the case, the team that dominates midfield would be the team that controls the flow of the game. And that, for me, is the area that's key today. And the starting 11 for Spurs. Hugo Lloris begins in goal. Hyung Min Son plays with Dejan Kulusevski out wide. And the responsibility of leading the line today goes to Harry Kane. The lineup for Manchester United. David De Gea between the posts. Jadon Sancho plays with Anthony out wide and the main striker today is Marcus Rashford And the match begins. Rashford getting forward. Rashford unable to get himself back onside here. Well, he was always going to be offside. That was the wrong option. Emerson. Now Romero with it. And we're looking at a player who seems to be at the peak of his powers, Hyung Min Son. In what way might he contribute today, Stuart? Well, Derek, he's a player that thrives on goals and he scored a hat trick last time out. And I'm sure we're going to see him play with great confidence today. He really looks to be a threat whenever he gets the ball. I think we're going to see another outstanding performance from him. Très bien. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. Malasia. Well, couldn't keep it in. Rebier. Well, showing excellent judgment to intercept. Very quick thinking there. Jaden Sancho. And now with Kulusevski. In behind for him to chase. Able to get a body in the way. Fernandes. Return to Rashford. Sancho. Element of risk there, but he's won the ball. Kane. 
now Son. And reading it absolutely superbly. Sancho. Malasia. Christian Eriksen now. Bruno Fernandes. Sancho. And back with Bruno Fernandes. Can they forge ahead? They do. And you've got to say, they're good value for the lead. Well, as the replay shows, this is all about his ability to find space in the box, which then makes the finish look so much easier. That's good play from him. Back underway here. How will Spurs reply to that setback? More than decent this from United. Rashford. Promising move. Dejan Kulusevski. A really committed challenge, and it's gone out for a throw-in. Poibier. Poibier. He got nothing but ball. He's conceded the corner. Who can they pick out? Not to be advised giving the ball away there. Dejan Kulusevski. Poibier. Few can finish quite as adeptly as Harry Kane. A goal for him. Well, just look at his strength here. He holds off the challenge, he keeps his balance, and he finds the back of the net. It's a wonderful goal. So back underway, one goal apiece here. And totaling up all the stoppages, we'll have two additional minutes. Scott McTominay. Half time then here in the English capital. Well, it was an agreeable first half display from Harry Kane. Stuart, your thoughts? Well, that's exactly what his team needed because they weren't at their best. And the second half has started here at the home of Spurs. Can he give them the lead? That's great goalkeeping. Well, what a save that is. He was so alert there. So the corner played into the box. Oh, he couldn't outwit the keeper. Relatively straightforward to mop up defensively. Ericsson. 
And back with Bruno Fernandes. And maybe Rashford! And keeping it out. Bentancourt. Deft read by Ericsson. Well, you have to think they're going to take the lead at some point. Because they're really looking dangerous at the moment. Real chance. What a save. Son. And now with Kulusevski. That's a very impressive piece of defending. Well, as you can see, United have dominated possession in the last 15 minutes and have played some really lovely football going forward. But they must now make it count and get themselves in front. Can't miss, surely! And a goal! Just like that, they're back in front! Well, here it is again, and it's all about the pace on the counter-attack. They were so quick to break out from their defensive positions. And what a finish from Sancho. He gives the keeper absolutely no chance. It's such a powerful strike. Manchester now having fallen behind, what sort of response will that elicit from the Spurs team? Richarlison. They do pass the ball with authority. Okay. Look as though they had attacking momentum, but not so. Ericsson. Now with Rashford. Son. Well, a really single minded piece of defending to make sure nothing untoward happened. Take some progress with the ball at his feet. He's in behind. A goal! That's two for him today. They simply can't stop him. No wonder he's celebrating. Well, here it is again, and it's all about the pace in transition. They're so quick to get out from the back. And what an emphatic strike it is from Sancho. Hit with his laces. It's a great goal. won the current scoreline here 20 minutes remaining Bentancourt chance to make a game of it here in it goes to alter the arithmetic and give them hope that they can turn this round Well, as you can see, his movement is really good, which then makes the finish look easy. That's a decent goal, that's for sure. So back underway, Tottenham still behind, but they're making this a contest. 15 minutes left for play. Fernandes. Perfect challenge. Hyung Min Son. Kane. And return to Son. A really top notch piece of defending. Anthony. Now with Rashford. Well, you've got to savour such moments. Rashford. Rashford! And a goal! They lead by two now. And that allows them to breathe a bit more easily.
Well, I have to say, he's done really well here. He's in the right place and then a decent finish. That's a good goal. So the current scoreline, 4-2. Son. Son. Crossing possibilities. Bentancourt. And still looking to get the shot away. And let's give credit to the defending. Oh, nice work to get past his opponent. Well, danger averted thanks to his teammate. So the final whistle, and it's a story of defeat for Spurs in this one. What did you make of it all? Well, Derek, I thought it was a subpar performance from them. Just didn't look as sharp as normal. And I don't think they deserved anything from the game. They need to get a better performance in next time out. That shouldn't come as any great surprise to hear us say this, but Jadon Sancho kept asking questions as the game progressed. Interested to know what you made of him. Well, I have to say, that was impressive. Not just his goals, but his all-round play. He was excellent. A potentially riveting 90 minutes in front of us. Tottenham Hotspur with the kickoff. Sancho. Can they forge ahead? And you've got to say, they're good value for the lead.